Hello, everyone. Delighted to be talking to you from one of my favourite venues in world football, the Orange Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner, Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason, it is Manchester United facing Barcelona. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea starts in goal. Luke Shaw starts with Aaron Wan Bisaka in the fullback positions. Marcus Rashford starts with Anthony out wide, and Wout Weghorst is the striker. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Robert Lewandowski. And so the match is underway. Lewandowski worth the try. Oh, keeper dealt with it. And strong play here. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. And space to cross it. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, there it is, the first caution of this match. Well, he didn't need to make the challenge, did he? He's under pressure now. It's a long time to go in this game. Showing a real will to win the ball. Fernandes. Giving the ball away. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. Oh, he's lost possession. Sergio Busquets. Well, a good tackle. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Not giving their opponents a moment's peace. Ansu Fati can he find the right pass well nothing comes of it it looked promising
Pedri. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Has eyes for goal! And the keeper more than equal to the task. Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. And the short option preferred. And crossed in there. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and they work it well just to change the angle on the cross. But look at the defenders. They lose their concentration, become sloppy with their marking, and as a result, they find the ball in the back of their net. Just not good enough. moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be went in strongly decisively Bruno Fernandes and a chance to level it well the chance Fred and a goal Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So, a level contest. 1-1. Anthony, Fernandes, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. De Jong. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And no more time left. We've reached the halfway mark here at the Orange Vélodrome. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser. It could prove to be the key turning point in this contest, as they haven't been at their best today. You do feel they need to find another gear in the second half, though, if they are to go on and win it. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Pedri. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Bruno Fernandes. Anthony. Now Casemiro. Veghorst. Oh, in with a chance. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Who can he pick out? And a struggle to get it away properly. Oh, body in the way, crucially. United looking to forge ahead. Let's see if the corner helps them. And the keeper left us in no doubt that that was always going to be his ball. Lewandowski. 
Manchester United recovering possession well. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Encouraging stuff from United. But they took care of the situation defensively. Beckhorst. Lewandowski. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Lewandowski. Well, he's lost it. Wout Weghorst. Can they create something from here? Has a go. Well, credit to him for trying it. Didn't miss by much. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Not the pass he had in mind. Rafael Varan. And the emphasis is on creativity. The course. And options in the center. Veghorst. Determined defending. Well, forward they go again. Can they win this? Terrific block. And a timely intervention. We can get more details on that injury situation from our man pitch side, Jeff Shreves. Jeff? From down here, it looks as though he landed actually on top of his elbow. That's why he's in so much discomfort, and that's why, of course, the bench are so concerned. Cheers, Jeff. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. And he cuts in from the wing. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Fernandes. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. And that's how to dispossess your opponent. Bruno Fernandes still pushing for what could be a winner. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. Well, the ball rolling again, no end to the action. It's the first period of extra time, and I must say, this has been a back-and-forth type of game. And the tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. Really important tackle. Now 
Now how about the short corner? A delivery from Dembele. Well, no real accuracy and easy for the keeper. And taking it away. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Oh, showing excellent vision. Oh, could be. And off the post. And pushed onto the woodwork. Really good challenge. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. Kunde. De Jong. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Half time in extra time, and still they are level. Torres with the try well on the grand scheme of things pretty straightforward for the keeper Bruno Fernandes Marcel Zabitza and it's United's turn now on the attack is this to be late drama now disappointing end to the move Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, a really important piece of goalkeeping at this stage. Well, it's such a key moment in the game. That's a really good save. And short it is. And played towards the near post. The clearance wasn't decisive. Tempele. Oh, well, that putting too fine a point on it. He's missed it. corner will they be able to cash in on it playing it in not all that convincing defensively well nothing comes of it locked together then these two sides and on we go now to penalty kicks And now it is all about the penalty shootout. A moment he dearly wishes he could have back. In it goes. And he steps up to take his penalty. And confidently converted. He had to score, and he does. Can he convert? And he's denied them from the spot. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. 
So much on the line with regard to this penalty. Oh, he saved it! It's all over now! Well, that's a decent save, isn't it? He read the penalty and then was good enough to keep it out. What a finish to this match.